again, everyone, and welcome to the Black Book Today from Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. I'm Sam McKee, joined by Bob Hollywood Hayden. The third and final session of the yearling portion of the Standard Red Horse Sales Company auction is in, and Holly, the checkbooks opened up like floodgates. That's right. Now, even with George Foreman in the house, there was no feeling out process here. The yearling buyers came out swinging and didn't stop until the final bell. And earlier today, we saw two of the heavyweight trotting trainers in the sport, Jan Nordine and Ron Gerfine, get in a bidding war for an Andover Hall colt named Lord of the Rings. He sold for a quarter of a million dollars. Nordine had the final bid, and that colt is headed overseas. It's a, it's a certain uh, uh, dramatic uh, urge to, to get the American horses because, uh, you know, when you combine them with the French uh, blood, for instance, uh, you get a very strong horse. And, and uh, that interest is increasing in Europe at this point. Much like the Manning brothers in the NFL, Peyton and Eli, they've become two of the top quarterbacks in that sport. We've seen a trio of brothers make a similar leap in the sport of harness racing. Well, the Manning brothers are certainly used to the center stage. Now we have three brothers, Andover Hall, Angus Hall, and Conway Hall, also getting used to being on the center stage. And why not? They're the three leading sires this year among freshman earners. They're all very uh, accomplished sires, and uh, they were all different horses, but they, uh, they all had a lot of good traits uh, that they shared. Can Bob Stewart do this again? Can you wind up with three horses like this again in your career? Well, one would hope, but I, uh, probably not. Okay. He's, he's a magnificent horse. He's a great horse. He's high energy, aggressive, without really being mean. Um, he's a good breeder. I mean, he's the kind of horse that you'd love to have 10 of. Murray Brown, the vice president and general manager of the Standard Red Horse Sales Company, is one of the busiest men here at Harrisburg this week. But we did catch up with him for just a minute to get his thoughts on this year's market. Good horses are selling better than they have sold perhaps since the boom days of the mid-80s. The averages are up. Uh, they're up pretty much in every category, trotting colts, trotting fillies, pacing colts, pacing fillies. If you have a very well-conformed horse, well-presented, Good pedigree, the sky's the limit. So the 2006 yearling portion of the Standard Red Horse Sales Company's annual auction is in the books, and Bob Hollywood Hayden renewed optimism throughout the sport, due in large part to alternative gaming measures that have supplemented purses in several states. And optimism was not just some kind of buzz bouncing around the room. It was actually reflected right there in the prices. We hope you've enjoyed the Black Book today. From Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, I'm Sam McKee, along with Bob Hayden. Thanks for watching. Okay. Oh. Now 95, 92, 95, so